I never carried a sword. It was pride, really. Back then, I could bring down anyone with my bare hands. smoke and shadow. Stand still too long, and you would feel the scorpions picking at your toes. But to reach them, I had to sneak through the old fortress where the bandits were holed up. It was built centuries ago by some shah or other. Every hallway was filled with traps, and those bandits didn't know about half of them. <laughs> but I did. I knew where to find the three levers that armed the traps. The first would reactivate a bunch of old gunpowder bombs. The second would fill all the fortress's narrow spaces with spikes. Finally, a trigger at the top of the fortress would cause the old fixtures and climbing points to collapse. gave way below me. Knives flew by my ankles. I can't believe I never once feared I would die. What kind of a madman needs this much security? It's not for me to question a shah.
trap was armed. It was time to infiltrate the conservatory. Conservatory, the chief had stationed his best, bravest men. I would leave them a gibbering, terrified mess. I had a choice. Terrify the chief's men, but leave them alive to tell the story. No doubt with great exaggeration. <laughs> or let the fear spread with blood and precision, leaving just a few terrified survivors. their friends saw, I knew they would run off in terror. Of them. Time to go back, down the torturous secret roads that led home. 